Hi, we're here at the Happy Cat Sanctuary. We wanted to do a video, uh, one last video before the winter, to explain to people what's been done the last two years in the sanctuary, what goes on here at the sanctuary, because right now we're getting so many um, emails uh, asking a lot of questions about how we do this, how we do that, um, you know, whether we're taking cats or not taking cats. So, the license will be still be long. I apologize up front. Uh, we wanted to, as I'm, we're showing the new outside of the sanctuary, uh, I'll try to explain as much as I can, and at the end, I'll explain as much as I can, okay? Uh, hopefully, I have I answered everybody's questions. So, we'll start with the waterfall fountains, because the waterfall fountains have fresh water running in them all the time. Uh, they're clean every, um, every week. They're actually three fresh water put in them. They have a filter that filters them at the same time, and there's fresh water going in. So, that's the story of with, 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 with the waterfall fountains. Uh, Michelle's doing the camera. It's going to kind of pan around. You can see the new perimeter here. Um, that's completely new. Uh, we didn't have this completed the last video. Um, a lot of the cats are hanging out because they want to eat the wet food, and we're going to give it to them right after the video. Uh, but you can see the whole perimeter is new. Um, and of course, then you can see this whole structure here. And actually, got one of the guys coming down the, the thing here. Um, what are you doing, buddy? You okay? Come on. Um, they love this. This is great. They have the hammock up here. There's a couple of cats in it now. Uh, this is all natural wood. Um, and I'm glad we got this completed. So we're going to continue on. You stop again? Come on. What are you doing, silly? Come on. What are you doing? <laughs> huh? All right. So come on. We're going to walk around. Um, we also, also, uh, this is also fresh water running in, in these as well. The cats, as you can see, the cats, they love to drink out of these. Um, I'm going to continue on here because we don't want the video to be, to be, to be too long. And, and you can pan that way, Michelle, to get a good look at that, at that structure. How the cats really love to hang out on that. Uh, and that one cat's still stuck over there. <laughs> Let me go. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing, silly? Come on. Come on. Come on. Get out of here now. Go, go. All right. So, so we're going to continue around. Uh, this waterfall fountain too, the same thing, it's uh, got fresh water running in, you can see the hose running in it. Uh, the cats love the cold, clean, fresh water, and we, and we give it to them. Our water bill is high, and there's a yellow jacket on your top of the hand. Um, it gets a little dramatic here, but let's not tell you. Um, so, the cats are going to all follow us because they think they're getting food, which they are, but uh, after video. You see the perimeter here, everything. Uh, it's all new, you know, all this, and of course, all these structures, as you know, in the previous videos, there are crates up in here with rugs in them so that they can, uh, and also the hammocks up there, they, they have a hammock, it's probably a little dark up there, Michelle, but come on, let's, we'll, uh, try to walk around quick here, um, let's walk through here, um, this is another structure that's got, 50 crates in there, all, you know, all up in there. You can go down a little bit, Michelle, and show them up in there, up up, uh, up in top. There's the crates. Uh, all right, come on. And then there's the, uh, the gazebo, which everybody knows about. It has all the crates, uh, the cool stuff in there as well. Uh, it's probably a little dark in there. The light's off. but um, And then uh, as, we, as we explained... This was the Whiskey Road Cats. Uh, these, most of these guys are in here. Actually, this is one from the Whiskey Road. Um, he actually became one. He became my buddy. Okay, there's, uh, he's a little, he's, he's a little, a little skittish. But he, this guy was, he was feral. Uh, you know, we had to catch him, in, you know, in a trap. Uh, hey, buddy, it's okay. You freaking out? All right. <laughs> but he's one of them, uh, and and he, he's and this is another one right here. Because they're actually looking to get back in. They want to go back in, but then they want to come back out, right? This is another one. This is another one from Whiskey Road. Uh, there are actually four of them that we let out of this structure. Uh, the other ones we're leaving in right now because we want to make sure that uh, they're okay and they're not going to get sick. Uh, and then we'll let them out eventually and we'll use the space for something else. Uh, come on, we'll, we'll walk this way a little bit. Uh, and of course, these are the finished sheds. They have um, everything in there. Uh, come on, we're going to walk through here. Okay, this is we have um, uh, there are five cages in there. Uh, it's all you know, nice in there. 
uh, nice and sanitary. Uh, these are for cats when they get sick, we treat them. Um, just so everybody knows, any cat that gets sick here, they get treated right away. They get a shot of antibiotics. It's a 10-day antibiotic, and if they have if they have diarrhea, we put um, the cats that have diarrhea. The cats that have bad chronic diarrhea go in here. They, they, they go in here so that they can be individually treated and put in a cage when it's cage space. Uh, the reason for that is we don't want we don't want the cats to contaminate the sanctuary. So this separate area is specifically for that, so that the cats, uh, and people ask, you know, uh, you know about that. Uh, we don't have a sick room. We don't have cats dying and, and, you know, everywhere. Are they all being cared for? Yes, they're living great. This place is, is beautiful, okay? Uh, anybody that has any doubts about having cats, call the, call the SPCA. Call, tell them that cats are dying here and they're sick and everything else, Everybody like, like some of these people do. That's what gets the, the SPCA out to go to a place. If, if you're that concerned, you know, I show videos all the time, you know, we just rebuilt the whole place the last two years. I did most of it by myself. Uh, I'm not looking for medals. I'm not looking for a pat in the back. This is what I do. I love, I love to help animals. I love all these cats that are all waiting to eat. 